Uh, Amishish says, At Arugda, how do you decide whether to attack face or minions with zombie chow? Um, oh, like earlier in the game with Razor Fed on the board. You almost always try to attack minions if there's any upside to it at all. The only time you attack face is when you can't find a single possible reason. Or like, there, it's such a weird situation in which it would have actually been worth it to like deal some damage with it. I will fight with honor. Because the damage you deal to his face is kind of not important, right? Like, the only situation I can really think of is if you have a buff, and so you don't want that thing damaged. Uh, like, ooh. Ooh. <laughs> like the best low drop. Yeah. Go. So, yeah. def uh, and then we want to think. So, do you want to coin out the Squire? Uh, so next turn we are hero powering. Yes. Right. So it would kind of make sense to coin and just get extra value out of it. Okay. I, I think but that's fine. It does lose our SI seven combo for quite a while. Yeah. Um, but if you are just hero powering next turn, uh, I think it it could be okay. But yeah, you do lose that flexibility. Um, it is a little bit awkward. Um, so, and then let's go through his potential turn two play. So, if he drops a two three, that's um, so a little bit bad for us, right? But it, it's, I think that would be worth it. Um, yeah, let's coin it out. I think, I think it's good. Okay. I think the flesh eating gives us a good turn three. So, yeah. Oh my gosh! Brutal. Just. Good game. Welcome to a one and zero. <laughs> yeah, I would dagger. Uh, okay. So we we actually could have thought about that play for a little bit. Um, oh, yeah. Trading no, no, for the two weapon. All right. Uh, so we could have thought about using the two the two two to hit into it. Um, it, it's fine. It's fine. Um, so it, I know it's like very instinctive uh you could just end the turn um a turn is done it's very instinctive to do that um because you can use the one health there uh because unless it's like a pyro shenanigan or something we could save the the charge on there right oh. right okay yeah yeah because there's essentially no difference between one and two health here exactly yep and we basically get to save the dagger because we see we're probably not going to be redaggering anytime soon right Okay, this is good for us. Yeah, that's that's our job. Yeah. Ooh. Uh, so okay, so this is where I kind of this is where I lose how to play aggro decks. I'm not sure how to strike that balance between trading and hitting face. So many mm. Okay, so what are you thinking of right now? Uh dealing with the flame imp and ignoring the technician okay so how do you do that uh well i hmm. well we could use hero power so to buff this up options. and trade into there okay which i guess we could use weapon to hit into technician and our divine shield which would leave us with two three ones and a patient assassin on board so we yeah should... i think that sounds good yep we're still one turn away from uh We're still one turn away from the, uh, the what is it, Dread Infernal, so I think this is fine. So remember guys, we were the ones to use the coin, um, and then if he does some like pyro shenanigans, okay. But you know, I'm not playing around pyro plus a spell. Um, if he hellfires this, that's absolutely fine, you know. Um, and we're just going to use up these things uh, in preparation for his Dread Infernal. Hellfire or Demon Wrath, that's fine. So, guys, we always want to remember that it's not so much about him being able to clear your board. It's also about things like, see what you have in your hand. Um, seeing whether uh, you still have enough, even in these sort of bad situations. Great. Tapping. We so, can get this Lava Burst to be 7 damage. Well, I, I mean, we... <laughs> How much damage do we Don't have? Don't we just win? 8, 9, 10. I don't 11, know. That's what 12. I'm trying to figure out. Yeah. yeah. I mean, we just win. 
Hi boys, you bring this home, my, my girlfriend said to go, so one second. Uh, well, no, don't, you, so you drop the drake first, because if it's a sacred trial, or like, if it's a sacred trial, then we don't win. It's not, we win. Good call, though. Yeah, so I don't want you, like, going all face, and then, you know. Yeah, no, that was a good call. I was not thinking about Sacred Trial, but that would have made it so we were one short. Yeah, yeah. That would be a two for two. <gasps> Ooh. That so poor many is gonna hurt so bad. No, 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 it's not. I don't know why you're making up these cards, man. Stop it. Cleon Admiral says, Arukta, you were thinking too much for the class you were playing. Agreed. Oh, look. We lost. We're screwed already. We, we, we passed, right? Wait, what? Why? What? No, you want to you... pass and then Bloodfen shield? Yeah. But then you don't have a three mana follow up. We shrink Meister after that. You could coin out. I mean, you if you want to coin out, I just think that it's. No, you're right. Yeah, like you're coining into a disadvantage, you know? You're right. You're right. Cool. Oh, Ooh. yes. Shadow Boxer coin. Power shield. Yeah, that sounds pretty good. Oh, yeah. Now we can do some crazy, probably not crazy stuff. We can do some stuff.